Number seven, Eric Brown. Number nine, Flock Gold Blossom. Number ten. tough ones to start out and uh, had uh, you know offense really wasn't uh, coming together early on defense still had a few things we needed to sort out same thing on our transition and that's been our focus for last week just really the, the foundations there but really just trying to start working out the kinks and uh, um, and uh, we knew going into this game that we're we're uh, using this as an opportunity to really fine-tune some stuff getting ready for LMU on Saturday so um, so yeah, so the guys came out fired up. They're ready for. They were ready for a W. They needed it, and so um, from the first whistle, they just they they never pulled back. It feels amazing, honestly, because uh, we came in fired up. We had three big losses, and we just went all out. We didn't want to conserve any energy, and we wanted to show what we're all about. So I think this was a good representative of what FP water polo is. Um, offensively, just really working on our spacing, just opening up a lot, um, seeing where our center's at, working towards that, um, and uh, really focused a lot on uh, on some uh, some movement on offense. Uh, we got really stagnant early in the season, not a lot of motion, um, so that was a big focus, just getting some more organized motion, guys knowing what the options were and um, looking to work towards those, as well as continue to uh, feed the ball to our, uh, our center. We were trying to practice some of our new moves, like a lot of driving, a lot of... Uh new post-up plays because we can counter. We are a pretty fast team, but we wanted to work on some little details which will probably help us a lot in the future. Just feed off that energy of knowing what it feels like to win again and uh, just hold on to that and continue to fight for it again because it's not going to come easy. we got some tough ones coming up.